Okay, you guys, two, two, two over here, get on this side. Is this, get two guys right here ready behind them in case something starts up. Okay, ready? Right there, let's get them. Together? No, I got, I got this one. Okay, you got this one? Oh, Alright, you got it, you got it by the way. I got it, I got it. Ready, ready, ready! On this capture, we move 40 pronghorn to uh, Arizona to start bolstering some of those populations. We moved approximately 75 animals to an area named Fort Stanton BLM land um, just outside of Capitan, in between Capitan and Lincoln. And then we moved about another 75 to 80 animals uh, to an area that BLM refers to as the Macho area just northwest of Roswell. We're gonna we're gonna ultrasound these these uh, these does and see if they're pregnant. If they're pregnant, we're gonna put a VIT, a vaginal transmitter, in there, and these will sit in there. And then when the uh, when they have their babies and they have their fawn, it'll fall out, be a mortality signal, and then we're able to track those babies and, and put collars and those for mortality studies. Okay, that's right. Obviously, we have to check and make sure they're pregnant first. So that's what. All this garbage. We're just gonna ultrasound this doe here if we can and see. We're gonna go on her, we're gonna go transrectal. Open air, we're gonna scan down on her uterus here. Let me get what I can see here. Just, there's the spinal cord, there's the baby right there. There's the spinal cord going across in a big amniotic sac. Kinda hard to see in the light, but that's a that's a baby animal right there.
or four tried to run up behind us, and one of them with a horn found the behind on me oh, no. and went through the dickies. 